The first carbon ion radiation therapy system in South Korea is hoping to open its doors next spring. Considered premium cancer treatment equipment, its assembly has been completed at the Yonsei Cancer Center in Seoul and is now set for final testing and adjustments if need be. Ian Jin with this report. This is a carbon ion radiation therapy system at the Yonsei Cancer Center. The extremely large size and shape of the machine is similar to radiation accelerators used in physics. But the difference is that the carbon ions this machine emits are much heavier than electrons or hydrogen ions. The heavier particles have more energy, meaning fewer therapy sessions are needed for effective treatment. And the biggest benefit is that there are significantly fewer side effects. X-rays shoot energy over a large area, then the energy gradually focuses in on cancer cells. But carbon ions don't affect surrounding cells and tissue and only emit great energy once they reach the cancer cells. Of the 10 balloons, if the seventh is the cancer cell, X-ray therapy requires the bursting of the previous six balloons to reach the seventh cancer cell, whereas in carbon ion therapy, none of the other balloons are affected and only the cancerous seventh balloon is popped. But not all cancers are the same. Cancer types where the cancer cells are fixed and don't move around the body are more easily treated. The first cancer type that the center hopes to treat is prostate cancer as it has a good prognosis. For prostate cancer, it requires 25 or 30 sessions with X-rays or proton rays. But currently in Japan, it is treated in 12 sessions. A shorter treatment period allows patients to return to daily life sooner. So far, there are only 15 such carbon ion radiation therapy systems in six countries around the world, including Japan and Germany. This one will be the 16th once the system goes through a six-month process of testing and fine-tuning. Actual treatment on patients should be available from spring 2023. The Yonsei Cancer Center hopes to at least double the survival rate of difficult-to-treat cancers like pancreatic, lung or liver cancer within the first five years of launching the carbon ion radiation therapy. Ian Jin, Arirang News.